Hello Malaysia, this is Jericho here and this is a Wait A Minute production. Today is the what? Today is the 6th of October 2013. It's a Sunday, so today I am at the Marjorie with a very noticeable hole in the middle of the building. Building. Let's give you a view of the place. Uh, hopefully you can see it. Nah, no, yeah, you can. You can see it. No problem. There will be a motor show in this March right here at the Jalan Usaha One something. And I wish they had better signs to direct a person to this place here. Because, well, it is hard. The only sign that has the March Ray sign is when you're fucking near under his nose. And that's stupid. There are a lot of, uh, a lot of bikes here. Big bikes. I guess they all came to see bikes and so far I've seen a lot of uh, sausages and no tacos Pretty tacos that is So this is the second time I've uh, been here The first time was at that uh, art show which I have yet to upload Hopefully in the near future because I'm a pretty pretty busy boy So hopefully we can find some uh, pretty ladies here Hopefully And hopefully it's not a sausage fest Not a sausage fest Hopefully you find somebody of the caliber of that uh, uh, Yahong art gallery That girl who looks like a Hong Kong superstar Very very cute Superbly cute Very cute uh, Well it took me 30 minutes to get here So it's much faster than uh, like say last time I think it took me about 1 hour but this is my second time here, so I'm making it in record time. Got about 30 minutes. And thank you for being on my bloody thanks. So this is a GTI is back. I uh, don't see no GTI. I can see a Renault. I think Peugeot. Sorry, Peugeot with the Lion logo. So I got one hour to film the place, and hopefully. Hopefully I'll get some nice interviews and see some nice bikes. I don't I'm not interested in the cars. The cars are well way beyond my my budget. So well we'll look and see. So let me finish my uh, puff the magic dragon first, then we'll get on cracking. And today I just uh, interviewed a very cute girl. Uh, uh, the one in uh, SS three uh, eating the chicken rice uh, not chicken rice I ate the roast pork rice very nice roast pork and to add to it very pretty girl and that's a classic bike from World War two definitely Put my helmet in my laptop bag. Wow, my helmet can fit in the laptop bag. Oh my god, my my helmet is big already. So holy shit! Now it's the first time that I can fit my helmet in the laptop bag. As opposed to hanging it next to my laptop bag. Unfortunately, my oh uh, yeah, sure, no problem. Okay, let's get on cracking. Let's see what we have in store at this place here. Oh my shit. Let's go to the front. There's the back there. Okay. And uh, there's some uh, cars on display here. Here and here. And fuck it. I'm not, I'm not interested in cars. Let's go and take a look here. Front should be there and thank you, don't kill the cameraman, thank you very much. And they have Puro Duo. Okay. 
Corridor as we know, or the M is it Corridor or the the My V. The My V is very famous for breaking well you just sneeze at it the the front bumper will just drop off definitely. So welcome to New Straits Times Auto Show 2013. A free admittance with three newspaper masks. Said. What? So we have the Civic Hybrid here. Nice. CRZ. Also nice. Two seater. Very nice. They don't have the. It's a hybrid. Uh, yep. It's a hybrid. It looks nice. Very nice. Do you have to pay to get in? Hopefully not. With the camera, of course, uh, and just get just walk in. Who cares? So let's go and take a look. Key, look key. There's a hall A and a hall B and a hall C. The hall B and the hall C is the one that had that uh, what should we call it? Archway. Fucking hell, it's very very noisy. Any pretty girls? Nope, nope. So let's begin at the hall B and C. A nice uh, bike here from NASA Rule, I think. Looks great. With the fucking hell, the look at the red uh, suspension, it's really big, it must be very heavy. It's something like the BMW motorcycles, there's no price tag, unfortunately. So we'll begin at the uh, anti clockwise. City Bank, what the hell are they doing here? Okay, all cars. Uh, no bikes, where are the bikes? Oh, I can see some pretty girls there. Oh my god, it's a Ferrari. I didn't come here for the Ferrari, I came for the girls. Definitely. Any pretty girls? Hiya. So, are you the girls for Ferrari? Sorry? Co coating. Oh, okay. So, uh, where are you from? Oh, KL. Eh? So, uh, both of you are Chinese, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, okay. Just uh, confirm me. Thank you. Oh, oh shit. Look at this uh, Ferrari here. The, the boot is very, very long. Very strange. And I thought that normally the boot would be very, very, very uh, short. Who knows? That looks nice. But it's longer than usual. Falali, eh? Falali. Oh shit, oh shit. My bag is a bit. Uh, hey, that's nice actually. Actually, my bag is a bit too long already, I think. So those two were Chinese girls, I did not know that. I thought they were Malays, uh, Malay girls with uh, very thick makeup. Because, uh, well, uh, quite pretty, yeah. Uh, but of course, it's not as what I would have imagined them to be. Uh, not to my specification. Let's see. So, no bikes. Don't see no bikes. I think it's going to be a very short uh, interview, or not short interview, a short uh, review of the place because most of them are cars, not interested in cars. I haven't seen, I haven't seen anything that uh, has caught my eye yet. 
And there's also a uh, upper part, I don't know why. Let's go up and take a look and see. This one pretty good eh? I guess this is the bike area so that's my forte or fort not forte, it's fort Vespa here Vespa here Vespa here and that's a pretty Malay girl at least I know that she's a Malay. Vespas, yeah. What's your name? Chi Chi, where are you from? Ampang, okay. Thank you. What the hell is this? It's like uh oh. God I hate it when there's a uh, so the songs are you're supposed to be copyrighted. Definitely. So what is this here? Hiya! So what's this? Harley Davidson, eh? Yes, it's Harley Davidson. So uh, what is it? Sportster. Sportster 72, eh? How much is it? Oh, 131,000, eh? Yeah. Oh, it's alright? Yeah. It's, it's chump change, eh? Yeah. So what's so special about this uh, bike here? Do you know anything about it? Uh, no, I'm not a salesperson. Oh, you're not a salesperson, I'm huh? Oh, okay. Oh, it's just about Harley Davidson company, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Oh, what's your name? Uh, Anna. Anna? Yeah. Oh, so where are you from? From oh, Petaling Jaya. Okay, no problem. Uh, so, how long have you been working uh, for this uh, Harley Davidson? No, recently. Oh, I the Harley -Davidson. oh is it as a? Event. Oh, oh, so, so what do you actually do? Uh, oh, we actually do best bike for public bank. Public bank. Oh, oh, public bank. Uh, for the what? Uh, administration. Uh, investment. Investment. Ah, uh. oh, so you must be very rich, ah, uh, <laughs> isn't it? Oh, this is for fun only, huh? Is, it, is the money good? Uh, well, uh, well, not bad. I guess not, not bad. Okay. Not bad, huh? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Welcome. Let's see, where else can I see? Ducati. So Ducati also is very, very expensive. But so far, why is the wheels a bit small? Uh, maybe it's the suspension that is uh, elongated because it's on top of the... whatever you... what you call it. So as I was saying, they were playing the Sai uh, song, so this fucking video will be copyrighted already. So I won't get some money, hopefully. I no way I'm going to get some money. So let's see here. That's a very, very interesting looking exhaust pipe. Two of them for this bike itself. It's a Ducati. So, and a very futuristic uh, facade for the front. Uh, reminiscent of that stupid Bellamy film about vampires, I forgot what's the name of it, uh, with that uh, Maggie Q. Uh, don't remember the. Oh, is it Preacher? No, it's not Preacher. Something else. It's based off a Korean comic. So it seems to be like it from the front. So let's. Uh, and here, this one looks. Okay. It has the same headlights, but it, this one is miles much, much nicer compared to this one because the color, this red color is shit, but this one all black, it looks nicer because it is something fucking else. So, so this one here, I like the, the backpack here. This one is um, polymer or something. So you can sit two people here. Uh, and in fact, he has an oversized uh, fuel tank. So, what about the in Very small LED. Hiya! 
Oh yeah. What's your name? Uh, Sorry? Saiful. Saiful, huh? So what? Uh, today's the last day, isn't it? Uh, today. Today, today yeah. Uh, until what time? Uh, I think eight or nine. Eight or nine. Oh, okay. Thanks, huh? Okay. So you're gonna be in YouTube. Okay, YouTube, YouTube. Okay. So far, no pretty girls. Uh, that one is more into my uh, my area. Quite a small section for the bike itself. I hate it when it's so fucking loud. Oh my god. This one is a very very big thing. So so far there is nothing much to see. Nothing to see at all, any particles, none at all. Okay. okay. Gotta get the fuck away from that place, it's a bit too loud. So there's some uh, some uh, helmets here. It's okay, go ahead. So uh, this one looks nice, I like it. This one is huge. The front part it looks like a manta ray, so that's very cool. Very cool. Yeah. Yeah. So and there's a backpack there as well. Uh, no, 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 actually, uh, I don't like all these type of uh, bikes uh, because it's a bit too heavy and you're prone to fall. So it's not so good. Not so good at all. So. So what brand is this? Ducati as well. So let's go on to the next thing. So we'll be moving up probably about 3.30 p.m. You have exactly another five minutes more. This one looks nice today. The engine is at the side there. So I... I don't know why is it like that double engines. So, that's nice. About 64,000 for this one. I can afford it, no problem. 99,000 for this one, no problem. I can afford it, no problem. So, wait until I get the lottery, then I can afford it. So, let's see here. Okay, the front part looks a bit weird, but uh, the weird factor is the most important thing. Right, so, I guess, uh, the, uh, the what's this Guzzi? I don't know about the Moto Guzzi uh, uh, brand, but uh, I think I like this one here. This one has a carbon, looks like a carbon fiber, because of the shine, it's not shine but it looks great. Yeah, it's a bit of a reason that you will be able to 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 be able
also LED display. This one I don't like it because look at the front there, it sucks. Looks like a person with a lot of specs. Fucking huge specs. This one, at least from this bike itself, I like this one. The, the whatever you call it. I, fuck it, I don't know. You can put your stuff here like machine guns and whatnot. Bombs, bazooka. No, bazooka is a bit too long. Maybe missiles and uh, rifle or small little guns, handguns. And the same job folks do take note of him. You also have a lot of great things which is happening, okay? In conjunction of this uh, only show, okay? For those of you guys who want to take part for the uh, People's Choice Contest, okay, all you have to do, the uh, entry form is in the, uh, the newspaper itself, in the uh, NSC newspaper itself. Get the entry form, fill it in, and drop it at the information counter, all right? Uh, also, you have a chance to read the Yama Star. This is a fat fucker. It's Kawasaki, that is. It does not look nice in front at all. But as usual, it looks very, very nice. That one here. And I can see a not, not a bad looking uh, girl. Uh, hey, actually, wait, wait. The white one. Okay, the guy is uh, like a cock dog already. The white one, uh, I think from the, the, front, the from the side, the uh, coconut nose is kind of be not so nice. But just uh, take a nicer look at the girl there. Definitely Chinese. So uh, let's take a look. Look. Okay. Uh, the one in the white is very uh, rough. One. Wow. You sit on it, also it gets fresh already. What the fuck? Oh, never mind. Oh my god, that looks like a very small bike. Almost the same size as mine. Uh, no, not really. Mine's a bit uh, taller. So, is it for the kids from 10 years and younger? And they have bikes, bicycle, the ones that you use your legs for. Cool. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. I haven't seen one of these for ages. Oh my god. Last time back in the 1990s and 1980s, they were all the rage, all these uh, bikes. But you don't see them anymore in the streets today in Malaysia. So, uh, 1990s, 1980s, sure, you can see this one everywhere. Any Tom, Dick and Harry and his mother and uncle and cat were riding one of these. But now, you don't see this shit anymore. Unless, unless you're a professional biker, or sorry, professional peddler. Uh, yes, and wearing very short, short polyester shorts. Uh, accentuating the profile of the dick and the sausage definitely those exist those are competition riders but uh, normal people normal folk they don't use this one anymore because well it is hard to control with the type of uh, handles like so uh, the profile of the person that needs to be like say is it horizontal you call it yep horizontal nowadays is always the <coughs> the mountain bike which I think this is a mountain bike. So what the fuck am I doing? Why am I going for the ped the bicycles when there are motorcycles here? So do I can I get an interview at least for, with one of the lovely ladies just now? Not the white one, but the red one. Uh, I think they have gone already. Mm. So ah, the red one is there, looking sexy for everybody to see. Okay, there goes my copyright. That song is by, what's his name? So a lot of photographers everywhere. So, I'm gonna ask about the name. 
So these ones are... Uh, I don't know what's the term for all these things but fucking hell, it's very very tall uh, Twenty-seven thousand. That's quite okay. Very, very easy. Oh, this one is the lower profile type of uh, uh, Kawasaki's. So I prefer these to the very, very tall ones. And uh, yeah. So let's see here. Any ball, anybody to interview? All the, all the people are digging around there. So I must well go for the ones that are somewhere else. Uh, that one looks quite okay, not bad. So well, it's almost to part two here. So not many pretty ladies anymore anywhere. So hopefully I can get to get an interview with somebody here. And uh, the music it will be like fucking hell, so loud. So let's see here. Just now it was by, is the name of the song is called the Riddle by uh, what's his name, Rick Kershaw, I think. So yep. So I'll see you in part two because it's around 26 minutes already.